Hi, I'm Randy Brown, your YRA year round athlete instructor. Today's lesson at second base is a double play, a ball hit at you, or slightly to your left with a jump turn. So there's six key points. Number one, always make sure you're in an athletic ready position. Number two, your route and angle to the baseball. Number three, your footwork when you feel the baseball. Number four, feel the baseball squared up. Number five, your transition into your throw. And finally, number six, make a good throw into second base. So back to point number one, the athletic ready position. Once the pitcher is delivering the pitch and as the ball enters the hitting zone, you want to creep step into your ready position. So the pitch is on its way, right, left. What this does, it allows for me to break on a ball once hit in a given direction. Notice how when I land, the knees are bent, the chest is over, elbows and hands are close to the body. What this does, it allows for quickness and mobility. Once I'm down, ball's hit, now I can go ahead and move. And point number two, you route an angle to the baseball. So the ball is hit, it could be hit right at me, it could be hit slightly to my left. And this is an option. In the other video, I talked about the underhand flip. This is the other option here, ball hit right at you. It's whatever you feel most comfortable with. So the ball is hit to my left. As I read this baseball, my route and angle is determined by the speed of the ball and the hop of the baseball. So once the ball is hit, I'm staying low to the ground, reading the hop to be able to go in to attack the hop that I want. So as I'm going to the ball, I'm staying low. Now I see it, which brings me to point number three, your footwork to field the baseball. It's what I like to call left, right, left. So once I plant on my left foot, I'm gonna go ahead and present. Now I'm going to break down on that baseball, right, left, to feel that baseball. As you can see, my left foot now is slightly more around this baseball. What this does, it minimizes the amount of jump turn when I have to make this jump turn. If I feel this ball like this, it's gonna really require me to make that big jump turn and it could throw me off just a little bit. So when I feel this baseball, I'm gonna be a little bit more to the left of the baseball with my left foot. Left, right, left. Which brings me to point number four, feeling that baseball. As I feel it, my nose is right over the ball. As you can see, my hand is on top, the fingertips are on the ground. The ball is placed on the inside of my right knee now. Again, this is gonna minimize the amount of jump turn because now as I bring it straight up, it's a lot easier for me to go from here to here than go from my left side and bring it all the way to my chest, which brings me to the transition. Point number five, as I'm fielding that baseball, as I'm bringing it up, I'm beginning to jump turn and starting to take it out. At this point, I'm sitting in my legs, my weight's on the, kinda in the backside of my feet, Knees are bent. My body now is facing towards um, second base. As I jump turn, I'm going clockwise into it. And which brings me to point number six, when I land, notice how I'm in a good strong position to throw. I'm staying in my legs. As I make this throw, I'm gonna throw from a three quarter arm slot. Nice, short, quick release. Playing the ball uphill to allow for my shortstop. Easier move and transition for him into first base. So I'm gonna give you a couple examples. Ball's on the way. Making sure you're staying balanced here. Last one. Planting that ball uphill. So remember these six points. Number one, always make sure you're in an athletic ready position. Number two, your route and angle to the baseball. Number three, your footwork when you feel the baseball. Number four, Feel the baseball squared up. Number five, your transition into your throw. And finally, number six, make a good throw into second base. That's turning a double play at second base on a ball hit slightly to your left or right at you with a jump turn.